I didn't realize I didn't have enough materials for that. These guinea pigs. I don't mind the sound of them, but like, I don't know. I know their fur is supposed to be really delicate. What does it say? Jeez, we've got a bit of wildlife now. And still nobody's researching. But the place is getting clean. We're, we're already on kind of task one, is that the place is getting cleaned up. And the hospital is coming together nicely, and I've moved it out of that room, which is great. What I want is once these get built and moved... Well, technically, I guess I don't have to wait for them to get built. I could just move them myself. Like this. Uh, mm, I'm going to select these easier. There we go. Nope, I don't want that. Guarantee I'll like click on a cat at some point. There we go. Okay. Now I want mm. to... Okay, solar flare doesn't really matter. We don't have solar. And we don't have electricity much anyway. Copy this setting. So we're going to put a little storage area up here going to have all this medical stuff in it once the batteries get built. For now I don't really care if the medical stuff is kind of spread out because it's kind of still close enough that it still is going to it's going to be used anyway. I am concerned about the quality of the food because apparently they keep getting food poisoning. And how many meals have we got? 46. That's okay. These stacks could potentially have food poisoning in them. I don't know. Maybe they do. So I need them to clean here too. All of flare doesn't affect windmills and stuff, does it? Look at this rat. Oh, I'm so easily distracted. Uh, let's increase this. I heard somebody mining, but I don't see him. Hey, Ambrosia. Ready to harvest finally. I don't really enjoy them having drugs. Um, as soon as I harvest something like that, I want it out of my base so fast. It used to be quite good um, when I could just call in a trader and be like, hey, come over in two days and, you know, in two days time all the drugs would be gone from my base by sales and stuff and I wouldn't have to worry about it so much. The horse is doing a great job, look at it go. Getting everything nice and clean. Oh, cow's back. Wait, so soul of, oh, soul of fire must affect everything electrical, not actually just solar. Makes a little bit of sense. Calm down temperature wise. Yes, I need batteries, but I need them to I really need them to research their pemmican so we can get some preserved meats and stuff. Yeah, I actually watched a, a video because I I didn't know what pemmican was and I didn't think pemmican was a real food. But pemmican's a real food in in real life. Um, I found this video of this guy that made it up and stuff, and uh, it's really quite cool. It's like you, you cook up meat until it's as dry as possible, and then you blend it up. Um, so it's almost almost like a shredded powder, almost. And I know that sounds so appetizing right now. And I think you add in like oils and, and something else to it. Um, I think it's like maybe vegetables or something like that that have gone through the same kind of process and it all kind of mushes up into this kind of solid bar and yeah they've just you can literally just put it in a glass jar or something on your shelf in the cupboard and it just lasts uh, for like months to years and stuff and it's like how cool is that like without this game I'd never even know that such a thing exists like I'm pretty sure if you're a survivalist type person you may already know this kind of stuff but I am definitely not an outdoorsy sort of lady. Um, I like my air conditioning and my computer. So <laughs> it, 
it was definitely news to me. I'm just sort of watching all the cats kind of moving around. I'm just like, I want to break up this room area. Oh, Lincoln's in there. Lincoln, do you need to have a bed in there? Is all these taken? No. Because you complained last time that you had to sleep in a shitty barracks, and I'm like, you chose to sleep there, mate. Yeah, everybody's got themselves a room now. Uh, I guess I could change one of these to like a prisoner thing if I brought somebody in. Yeah, weeks and champion there. Yeah, I'm just hoping that um, for all the ladies that keep cracking on to chimpanzee, like I hope that he doesn't end up like changing and uh, doing what Tofu did and just like changing wives. Uh, just because, like, Wix is pretty cool. And all these ladies just keep, like, going from, like, I kind of get it. I'm pretty sure Tofu and Lincoln are young. Like, almost criminally young. So he really is, like, the only guy that's getting around that's in their age bracket. Um, I'm pretty sure Tofu is 15 and Lincoln's, like, 14. And he's, like, 29. Oh, he's a lot older than I thought he was. The ladies are kind of like 19 up kind of thing. That makes a bit more sense now, actually. But yeah, this quest, I don't think I'm going to take that. I just, I, I, I have no, I've never figured out how to use a Resurrector Mech Serum. Ever. Like, even with like all the advanced medical stuff and stuff, I've never figured it out. Once they've died, I'm just like, I'm fucked. Um, I do like getting Jade. I'm very easily tempted by Jade, which is funny because like Jade in this game looks so nice. It's such a really nice green, but I actually hate real life Jade. Um, I'm not a fan of it at all. Um, and you get like a lot of like carved jewelry and stuff like that in, in real life Jade. Yeah, look at this place. It's looking so clean now. So clean. Oh, except for a couple spots in there. And the stoves are out. So, okay, the best thing about them having the wood stoves at the moment is it's not drawing on my electricity and it forces them to stop and do something else occasionally. And the only reason why they're not hauling stuff to it is because hauling's reduced. Hmm. Oh, i up. I still don't know about these air conditioners if I'm doing the right thing with them. Oh, did it now? No, no, no. It did not self tame. It um, it just offered itself up. That's all it did. I don't have that mega sloth though. I don't think any of these have some good like wool. They've got skin and meat, but I mean, my people are finally doing some other stuff at the moment. Good. We've almost got our hospital wing up and running. It, it's pretty much almost there. I just want these extra beds, I guess. I should just scroll down a little bit. Get it about there. Of course. You can do it. Oh, fuck. I have to. Oh, damn. Okay. Guys, I need just to wake up. What hour is it? It's like 1 a.m. for them. All right. Pretty sure Tofu is supposed to be awake. Where's Lincoln and Pop? They're all down near the bottom of the base. Come on, I need people up here. What you got over here? Let's put that there. You three. I know you're asleep and it's outside your hours, but I'm going to need a rescue team. I'm guessing he's going to... He? Going to maybe come down this way? Or that way? Okay. Chimpanzee, I really need you to just go rescue her. See if we can get her in the medical wing. Don't run past it! I kind of really expected better then. I 
know you just shot one of my panthers, Tofu. I'm not really impressed with that. Okay. You can go back to what you're doing somewhere. Save it at this moment, just in case. There's always a just in case they won't make it. And I'll have to reload and take take the initiative to get somebody to get medical stuff out there instead. See how we go with this. She's only got five hours. One of those animals was pretty hurt too. Twelve hours on that. Costa, get up. Start tending. Twelve hours. I don't know. Lumi can do it too. Two horses here. Shit. Two hours. Okay. Amiya is probably closest, but she's doing it. Chimpanzee? Bloody go for it. Just tend to her. They're all roughly medically equal. I don't really care who does it, so long as somebody gets in in time. Oh, that's close. She's going to be in there for a while. How the uh, panthers go? She might lose that one, just because she lost a bit of blood. Hmm. Yeah, so what I didn't realize before is I left these as medical beds by accident. What I actually need is these rumbo ones. I sit about there. I can select them. To be medical. So you guys. Not a medical bed. Nor are you. I think. Yeah, no, that one's already not a medical bed. Okay. Now, now, whenever they're injured, they should hopefully come down here, so I can hopefully treat them as a group. And you know what? I might actually get rid of these. It might be worth it to have the medical stuff right there in the center with them. I love how it says low medicine. As soon as you get rid of a storage area, it's like, nah, nah, nah. It's, it's cool. I've actually got quite a lot, but, you know, it doesn't take so. Closest staying 15 degrees. She's a medical emergency. Yeah, she's still still in a lot of pain. Ooh, we're getting another buffalo. At least they're getting some researching done. That's why I didn't want to pull um, earlier. I saw one of them doing it over here. I can't remember which one it was though. They should be right for all of their... I should not need to make any more bricks at the moment. I do need to fix that up, but this is why we've got a double pen. I just send Mio up there. Cleaning dirt like a champ. Oh, we don't have wood. Really? Ugh, no. We don't need any more miscellaneous pets right now. So I was about to do something, I can't remember what. Oh yeah, that's right, I was going to suspend the stone cutting at the moment. Because I don't think we need it. And honestly, I don't think we really need the jackets at this point. So I'm going to suspend that. I am going to let them start making the summer stuff going forwards. Won't be good right now, but hopefully if they get some wood going, we can maybe get this out of the way. Let's get some wood chopping. Chop them up with you. I mean, they've got wood chopping to do right next to that. I was going to call it base, but I'm like, it's base or a house, but it's base. Hmm. Uh, is there something conflicting with what's falling down? With what they're doing, maybe. Could be related to the hauling, maybe. Well, let's. Let's ramp back up the growing stuff since they've finally done what they've needed to do. And I don't want any of the researchers who have falling as a priority.
because I figure if they've got hauling and cleaning and then researching, none of them will research. So hopefully that will work. I'm hearing some trees getting cut. I don't know where it was. Dry thunderstorm, huh? Well, that's going to be a lot of electricity. Oh. Rumbo's on fire. You gotta stay out of the fire, mate. Understand if you got zapped. Like, that's unfortunate. Where's my animal? Uh, Panthers are getting trained. I want some of these to end up bonded and named. Even some of the original Thrumbo calves, because usually I'll keep maybe up to about down to here. All this would be kept animal in number. But. They have to be named, otherwise it doesn't really matter to me, because I'll just sell them off or slaughter them or something at some point. These ones are all getting, t they're all getting trained. Are you unhappy with, why are you bonded but not with, anyway. All the kittens are becoming cats. Cats, I really wish when they became cats they'd come up here or something underneath where the cats are, but I mean, there's, the cats are only up there because they're named. The place is lovely and clean, so this is a stark contrast to when I started today. It was absolutely grubby everywhere. Like, I don't think there was a spot that was actually clean. So, they've finally done their cleaning. I've got a good amount of leathers and stuff. They're doing their trees. I'll let them, I'll let them spend a couple minutes just cutting down trees and just supplying some wood and stuff around the place. Because once they do that... Um, then, what was I going to do with them then? I guess I want to see them start like researching and stuff more. They do have a nice amount of meat though. I know it stores all the meat at the bottom of this now. Like, over two grand in some of these. As long as it doesn't expire through summer, that's fine. They've still got some long-term meals, but they keep eating them. I kind of was making these fresh meals with the hope that they would eat those instead. But they're kind of not picking those up. And I don't know if they're just because they're a simple meal or if they want something better or what. These better be unfertile. Good. No more putting eggs in here that are... That one's fertile. That one's fertile. Is this not kicking them out? Let's see, cooked. Uh, I think it's raw food. Animal products. Yeah, you're not allowed to have anybody fertilized eggs in here. What are you doing? I guess they probably don't have anywhere else to go. So, I don't want to create a storage area for the unfertilized eggs. Um, because I do need them to, like, be here. These are all spoiled anyway. All ruined by temperature. Except for that one. Well, if that's the case, I'm gonna have to take them in. I don't want to, but I'll have to change it before I get, um, any kind of poultry again. Change that. And your meals are gonna have to include... Uh, the, um, the fertilized eggs. At least for now, at least one of these stations will accept them. I don't think the other ones do. Yeah, they don't accept fertilized, and you, you do. Okay, so two, two out of three stations have currently accepted fertilized eggs. And I really just want to use them up. I would like this one or two that's up here actually stay but I know that the panthers will move them too. There's nothing I can do about that. These guinea pigs. I want to kind of cull some of these guinea pigs already. Where are they? Oh yeah they're here. Okay. We've got three males and the rest of them are females. Don't really need that many females to be honest. Go around and see what colours they are. That one's black and white. I'm choosing between the ones that are not currently pregnant. Or orange and white. I don't mind 
orange and whites and stuff like that, black and whites. I don't know if there's any other colors. 